We found my grandfather in 2001, and in the past 10 years, so much has happened to link us back to his Cheyenne home, to our ancestors and our relatives. Keeping our family together, that is spread right across the world, is just such a mammoth task. Mum has travelled to Burnie Day Cemetery when she first um, found um, Alfred. I have visited America and Northern Cheyenne twice. My daughter Samara came with me the second time. My brother Mark has gone there twice and we've met Laurie and Frank in Vancouver one summer. Um, our plans and those of our relatives in America have had to be laid aside at times because of life circumstances. Laurie and Frank visited Rocky and the Sand Hills one Christmas and Laurie also attended my daughter's graduation from medical school and she was presented with a Cheyenne style white buckskin beaded dress that was uh, made by Laurie and Sam wore that proudly that day. Samara has a three-year-old son, our grandson, and he brings much happiness into our lives and we keep busy uh, with the cattle. We um, are very busy with the family's cultural business and just staying connected to family and dealing with family things. Our mum, Evelyn Stella Walkon, who is the daughter of Alfred, um, loves her life here in Australia. We keep our walk-on little son family connected with the help of social networking and Skype. And um, I do also um, ring Northern Cheyenne. The Moccasin Telegraph and the spirit of my grandfather's land is very powerful and it continues to draw us back to the lands of the Cheyenne. So we're always planning to take another trip back to Northern Cheyenne um, to visit family and, and go to the cemetery.